Alright. Welcome back to another Starcast TV and I am Scan. Today we're gonna see some very cool games between Light versus Shuttle, Shuttle versus Light. A spawning location in the top right, the white Terran, this is light. And, and the other side of the player, spawning location in the bottom left, the brown Prados, this is shuttle. And we're gonna be seeing some Terran vs Prados matchup on Eclipse. And Eclipse is a two player map. And let's see what Shutter is going to be doing. Light is going to be putting down the supply depot right underneath of the command center. And it looks like Shuttle is not planning to do some uh, harassment in the beginning. Putting down the gateway, so far very standard. No 12 nexus, no proxy gate, no gas steel. <clears throat> so we're gonna be expecting to see some standard play by both players. And whenever both players is playing standard, it is definitely a good news for Terran. Because they don't need to deal with any proxy building. Light is going to go for the scout and he won't be taking the gas. So he probably thinks shuttle is playing standard or 12 nexus one or the other. He knows this is not a, any proxy gate. So this is, this is a very good choice by Light going for... He's planning to go for Rex expand so this is a good news. Adding more pylon. Cyberner scores halfway done. No Zala production on the way. Finally going for the probe scout, but SCP and the pro will be meeting each other at the ramp. SCP will go in and figures out there's a cybernetic score. And as soon as Light figures out, hey, this is a very classic, classic cybernetic score standard build by Prados. So I'm gonna be doing for finery. So this is not going to be a ga uh, Rex expand. This will be a gas expand. So he will be making a single marine with the refinery into 19 command center but he's not gonna be putting okay he will be putting down so if that probe was coming in he will be trying to hide that SCP as much as he can that was what he was planning to do scouting SCP is still alive buying some time and will be escaping before Goon comes and yeah, the Goon just came out I think uh, he wants to for shuttle to chase this SCB a little longer. Factory already started. Only a single marine. Only a single marine factory already. This is a, there's a probe still standing. Seeing that a marine. That a SCB somehow has 20 HP remaining. Will be surviving but the probe was chasing so the probe will last it. Okay, Drigan was hitting, uh, hitting that uh, SCB last it. We'll be taking it down. Bunkers on the way, but we can see the factory is really, really, really fast. Uh, scouting SCP was buying the time really well. Shuttle, shuttle is making. Yeah, I think this is a one gun nexus, one gun nexus into second gun, and finally making the robotic facility on the way. So now shuttle knows this is a command center. 7 SCVs, second factory already started. Pumping a lot of SCV by uh, light right now. This is very good. Gun range now completes. Starting to go for the harassment at the bunker. And it looks like uh, I have a feeling this is going to be a 3 tank push. Is he going to be adding the machine shop? Yeah. I may assume this is going to be a 3 tank, three tank push because he saw the Nexus started by shuttle. And this bunker won't lose much of a mining time 
repair will, uh, SCP will be repairing the bunker, but not gonna be losing much of the mining time because of the grim pressure. It wasn't too fast, and the f uh, first tank just came out at five minutes five seconds. But that's really fast. Two, th uh, second and a third tank on the way. Already at 32 work account by light. Already has four marines out of the bunker. The barracks is gonna have all those of uh, vision. Uh, speed re speed research with the spider mine research research at the same time. Light will be making a lot of SCV here, and we'll be finally adding the eBay. And with the SCV scout, I think he's gonna go for the scout at the nine o'clock side. So scouting the nine o'clock, and with this a four marine, four marine, and with the three tank. These two vulture will move out at the same time as well. The SCV will be checking that uh, 9 o'clock expansion and these 4 marine with the 3 tanks already has a ride at the 9 o'clock side. But let's see what light is gonna be deciding to do. But we can see Shadow is gonna go for the Reaver build. Only 4 guns. Only 4 guns and he's making 2 Zala with the 1 Reaver. We'll deny this push. He has a river inside, but the siege tank is pretty much focused already on the pylon. The pylon will go down, the river will be on low, taking one one vulture and one marine, two marine, that's good. Finally starting the second ne uh, third nexus, adding more gateway, slowly. There are two Zala with the one river inside, plus one attack started as well, academy as well. Finally, he will be unloading a little bit of a vault. The spider mine will be triggering, but I gotta be careful. Nice river micro baiting the spider mine. But this third expansion is a little bit vulnerable. Zala mine drop, that's uh, Zala drop top of the spider mine. That was very good. Speed shuttle is now complete. Two, uh, two gateway gun, crush, uh, gun production. Finally, Light is pulling back his seize tank. Adding more factory by light. Is he gonna be adding all the way up to 5 fact? Okay, I guess he's gonna be adding some missile turret as well. A couple of uh, collides will be at the main base, but the speed shuttle will be unloading. Got a one tank shot. And we'll be able to kill one of the SCB, but still not enough. The SR uh, Reaver is dangerously low HP. That's not what uh, Shadow wants, and Shadow needs to be careful with the Observer. If this Observer will get uh, taken down, he won't be able to see any additional information later on. There are a total 4 Missile Tread. More Missile Tread being built. Finally transferring the probe. One of the probes got picked up by the Vulture. And we are going to be seeing uh, one comes at station. And now he will be able to confirm there's a cyber nice core was spinning. Double Stargate was being built. Fleet Beacon already started as well. And Light is playing really well here. He's already having all the way up to uh, 6 factory. 3. There's a 3 siege tank hiding at the 11 o'clock side. So shuttle tra uh, totally forgot about this three tank at the eleven o'clock side. And if light brings, if light is able to bring this uh, three siege tank and merge with the main army, that is going to be very scary. Couple of ultra will be rotated to the map and put some spider mines. So shuttle needs to be careful. Whenever he's pulling back his army, he won't be. Okay, he's going to be pulling back the observer on time. So. So you gotta be careful. Shuttle is slowly going for the carrier switch, but these gun with the reaver are trying to buy some time really well. Clearing the spider mine. He does have four 
five and maybe another gateway, six gateway maximum. Gotta be careful with this pylon. We'll be taken down. Adding more pylon. Good. The reverse buying time. Clearing the spider mines finally. Uh, Light did unseize the seize tank at the 11 o'clock site. He will be slowly moving forward. I think Shuttle is thinking about that uh, Light is taking the third expansion, but Light is not taking the third expansion. He is planning to bring all of his army. Ooh, the Shuttle needs to be very careful. Bringing the uh, three tanks over here from the 11 o'clock site, so that is going to be total. Wow, that's total 12 tanks. So there are a total 12 tanks and shuttle will spotting these three uh, seize tanks. We'll be firing the scarab. Uh, we'll be taking one, one reaver. But we'll be taking away uh, all those uh, three reaver, three seize tanks. Scarab will fire and the scarab is not chasing really well. Finally more collides being made. Slowly moving up by light. There are 11 tanks with the one group of vulture and with the seven goliath. Gotta be careful. The sea tank will be firing on the reaver. The reaver is dangerous and low HP 26. Shuttle will go down. Nice and scared shot on the goliath. Slowly pushing. Observer will take him down. Cost keep moving forward. Macro on the way. And at the same time, uh, shuttle. I thought shuttle was taking an expansion at the five o'clock, four o'clock site, but he was just putting down the pylon to deny any any of a hidden expansion that light can do. Shuttle does have a lot of worker, sixty-five worker, and with the four eight eight gateway with the Zala speed already finished. There are only two carriers, but there's a lot of these tank. Light has a lot of these tank. 65 Pro. That is definitely a lot more carries gonna be coming out soon by shuttle. But this army is dangerously strong. Plus one attack already finished. Vulture will be attacking the Zealot. Was that a 1-1 one -one upgrade? Yeah, that is already 1-1 one -one upgrade by light. But the Goliath is doing some damage to kill some interceptors, but uh, some of the goons at the behind will get killed. What is this? Oh, okay, so that is an SCV. There's a uh, more SCV should be coming down soon, I suppose. But now, uh, not much of a sea stain remaining. Only four sea stain remaining. Shuttle is now losing a couple of probes. He needs to pull back his probe before he gets killed. Oh no, the probes are getting exploded by the vulture and the sea stain shot. The vultures, that's a lot of vultures, will be laying down the spider mines. So the natural expansion, the nexus will go down very, very soon. And one one tank, uh, I think he wanted to send one tank to the 9 o'clock side and st slowly kill the pylon, but he, he didn't think about that there's gonna be two guns will be standing. There are now four carriers out on the map. More carriers? Okay, now never mind, he's not making more carriers. So he's now getting that, uh, I wanna see the upgrade. That must be the plus two attack uh, on the way for light. Light is adding a lot of spider mines at the natural, a little bit of a missile turret. Speeding up, and now he's making sure whether uh, Shuttle has a hidden expression over here. Bringing more Goliath and a more Seize Tank by Light, and Light has, uh, what is it called, a 2-2 upgrade on the way already. So a 2-2 upgrade on the way, taking the third expansion by now. But these number of carriers is gonna be slowly taking down a couple of a seas tank one by one. Nice micro. More carriers being produced. And Shuttle has a lot of ground army. Goon, Zealot are finally moving out. And now these seas tank will be cleared, up, cleared by the interceptors. So Shuttle is on a very good spot right now. He secured that third expansion and now also building the nexus at the natural. So this is not a good news. Light's main base is going to be mined out soon. So Light really needs to secure this uh, 
12 o'clock expansion, the third expansion. Mortal Army is coming. The Vulture did not lay some of the spider mines. He really needs to lay some spider mines. Focus Horror getting on the good and top of the Goliath. There was the top side of the Goliath was Focus Horror on the carrier, and one of the carriers is gonna be uh, having low HP. Uh, 200, uh, 292 HP remaining. There's a lot of Goliath still out on the map. 2-2 upgrade should be finishing soon for light. Yes, it is going to be done in maybe 30 seconds or so. More carriers being made by shuttle. Shuttle's main base is going to be mined out soon too. So he really needs to take this natural expansion. And I would like to see what light is going to be deciding to do. He, light is adding more factories. So this is going to be total 8 factory by light. This uh, third expansion is secured, adding a little bit of a missile turret and a spider mines to buy some time as well. There are definitely a lot of carriers, but we know Light is having a lot of factories and slowly having a lot of sea tank and a Goliath count as well. A couple of our vultures were rotated to the top side. I think he is trying to confirm whether Shuttle is taking another expansion over here. We hear some of Scan. Oh, he wanted to pick up some of the Observer. The Vulture has 2 to upgrade. Finally, Shuttle brought a couple of carriers. There are 6 carriers. We'll be attacking the Nat. His armory just finished upgrading 2 to upgrade, so. Uh, I guess Light does not have much of a resource remaining to go for the more upgrades, but the 6 carries is going to be doing great, great job. Taking down the barracks, taking down some of the CV or the Light as well, one by one. Okay, repairing the barracks. I heard something explode. Oh, that must be the pylon. Shadow is going to be adding another Nexus at the 5 o'clock side. Shadow is going to have more carriers. So this is going to be total uh, 8 carriers by Shuttle. Shuttle is getting that plus 3 attack on the way. A couple of vultures will be rotated. I don't see any uh, transition by Light. Light is making a lot of vultures right now. A lot of sea tank as well. This uh, couple of vultures at the 10 o'clock side is denying the expansion really really well. But Shuttle decided to take the expansion at the 5 o'clock side. These 6 carriers are still out on the map. And constantly attacking Light's natural. This is not a uh, good news for Light because these six carriers is pretty much doing great job. Now his this six carrier is gonna be taking down one of the armory. Light one by one, but at the same time, Light decides to move out. It's a small army here. Guns will be going back home. Eight carriers are out on the map. Using a couple of scans here and there, finally he decided he decided to move out. Uh, one group of a pro will be transferred. Uh, both, both of the player has about the same amount of worker. Uh, this base is completely saturated. Uh, maybe a little bit of a pro he will be needed, but he is right now busy focusing on this carrier micro with the observer as well. This carrier is definitely strong. Plus 3 should be finishing soon. I would like to see the cybernetic score. Cybernetic score, the plus 3 should be finishing soon. The car interceptor is gonna have plus 3 now. And Light is right now behind of upgrade. 2 to upgrade versus Prados. These carriers are pretty much taking down the interceptor. The uh, Light one by one, nicely done. Goons are on a hold position. Zealots are also on a hold position. Light is somewhat a semi all in at the moment, but there's gonna be a battle here. But these carriers are so strong, but Goliaths are not gonna be able to take down any of the uh, carriers. And goons are pretty much doing the free DPS to Goliath and the Vulture. And now these Goliaths are dangerously low number of uh, amount of a Goliath. This is definitely not a good trade for Light. And Light taps out. Light couldn't keep up the game anymore. Shuttle takes this game. Wow, I, I, I was really impressed. I thought 
Light was gonna win the game as soon as he was able to take down the Nexus over here. But somehow, with the first two carrier and the four carrier that he uh, Shadow started to have, somehow he started to snowball. And at the same time, remember the time when he was about to uh, lose his third expansion? Somehow, Shoto got a lot of army. He got like three groups of army with the Goon, Zalad, and slowly clearing the natural. That was impressive because I thought Shoto was behind, but somehow he got a lot of army out of, out at, out, got uh, getting out of his army from his main base and securing the expansion. And I think that changed the game here. That's a very good play by shuttle thank you for watching and if you guys enjoy watching these great games on starcast tv please hit the like and subscribe button we will bring more awesome games in the future